Good, you? Good. Good. We are off to Sunrise Medical. And I'm going to tell you what that is in a minute, but I'm going to let Jake get in the car first. <laughs> we are headed to Sunrise Medical, and they are this amazing company who provides medical supplies and wheelchairs. And when I climbed Kilimanjaro, they made a specialized wheelchair that we were able to use ish on the mountain. And then after, when I came home, they asked me to be an ambassador. And part of the program is that they provide me with um, uh, a wheelchair. And why this is so amazing and why I love them is because, I don't know if you know this, wheelchairs are expensive. They're thousands of dollars. And so I am like a so grateful for them and they're just really nice people. Um, so I, I always genuinely look forward to going to their office. So we're gonna go pick out a new wheelchair for the year, which is exciting. It's like almost like getting a new car. It's going to be custom. Tank wheels? Like, we'll see. Okay. Yeah. I'm glad we're open to that. Yeah. Making my way downtown, walking fast, faces pass and I'm homebound. All right, so we're about to head into Sunrise Medical. I just want to be very clear, I don't get paid for this. I genuinely believe in the work that they do and they hook me up with some cool gear um, to use throughout the year. So that's why we're here. If you want more information about them, I'm pointing to my head, but what I really want to do is point <laughs> down because I want it. Anyway, here's where you go. I'm a hot mess. First line of the description. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and if you want more information, please jump directly into my brain Yeah. and you can find it all there. Exactly. Whoa. Yeah. Looks really cool. So yeah. the cool thing about this, are we just good and why we're? What are some things that people don't know about getting a wheelchair? So there, there's like custom things. So you have to find your center of gravity because if the center of gravity is off, you will tip over easily. <laughs> um, for me in particular, center of gravity is really important because a lot of folks that are in wheelchairs have the weight of their legs to hold the front down. Yeah, so for me, that. I don't have that. So if if I'm and, and maybe you've seen if I'm like climbing a ramp, I have sometimes have to lean forward because. This just automatically does that. So center of gravity is really important. The width, and I like my wheelchairs to be a bit taller because I'm already short to begin with, so we get them a little bit taller. I like to have extra space here to put things if I need to. So those are some of the things. And then looking at the types of wheels, and the types of rims. So these are new rims that I tried, which are sort of oblong, but normally they're just like round bike rims. Mm. Um, and then the spokes as well. So I'm very scientific. Yes. I'm one of those people that pushes my wheelchair from my spokes. And I've had other wheels where I will break all the spokes because my arms are so huge. <laughs> <laughs> no comment. Yeah, it's not true. Okay, so we're inside, inside Sunrise Medical and I'm with Ron and Dominique and we just did all the measurements to order my new chair. Um, so maybe you guys can introduce yourselves and, and who you are and sort of what, also what we did today. Yes. Hi, I'm Dominique Sedleski. I'm the marketing director here at Sunrise Medical Canada. So I'm Ron Claude. I'm the local uh, sales representative for Sunrise Medical. I've been working a long time uh, with Sunrise and, and specking out manual wheelchairs. So we're really excited that Spencer's looked at uh, the new RGK Sub 4. Yeah, yeah, so in probably two months, we're gonna yes. have the new chair, so stand by. We're Thank on our way. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Spencer. Yeah. <laughs> Guess where we are? Backstage in the underbelly of the Air Canada Center. Uh, could you not? They know what they're doing. I'm probably not supposed to be back here. We were just hanging out in the Raptors locker room. We weren't. But there's an office space up there where the production team and we had a meeting and now we're gonna go do rehearsal and right now where we are is what we call Q-Line. And if you've seen other Wee Day videos, you'll know what this is. But if you haven't, I'm gonna tell you again. This is where we come and we meet with the talent team that works the table and then they hand us off to the next people that will get our mic and then they take us to the floor directors that will then take us to the stage. That's a lot of people. It's a lot of humans. But it works. It works really well. Okay, cool. Yeah. 
And brand space. Yeah. Ta da! To my right, your left, is the stage. And what's cool is there's a ramp on either side, but it's also terrifying because when you come down the ramp, it's just dark black holes in the middle on either <laughs> side. And this is the stage we use for the broadcast in LA. And when I went down, I legit normally I'm like, oh, it's a stage, it's fine, I know where the edges are, but when the lights come up, it's super bright and super, it's a little scary. The pit of death? Yeah, because <laughs> it's it's that or break your face on the floor. <laughs> Ramp, pit of death. Ramp, pit of death. Same on the other side. We're going on a trip to the oh, ramp at the back okay. of the stage. Dee 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 dee. With Spencer West. We're going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship. Zooming through the sky. Little lights die. Little lights die. Little lights die. Climb aboard. Can't forget the ship. Climb aboard. Get ready to explore. There's so much to find. Little lights die. Little lights die. Okay, we're all sound checked in. Yeah, that's it. We got to. We got to do the whole stage. The stage is so big this year. So it's huge. It is huge. And that's it. Okay, just a quick one. Go leave your mic back. Yeah, don't I'm going steal to. it. No, I won't. They don't like that. <laughs> We're leaving the arena. We're <laughs> leaving the arena. We're just leaving the Air Canada Center, and we're with Amanda Wand again, who is next to me. And we're gonna do the raising of the gay flag. We usually do it at our office, but I brought it with us so we could do it here at the Air Canada Center. So that's what's about to happen. Woo! Get ready and love it. Okay. <laughs> Her gay. gay. He's gay too. Yeah. It's <laughs> <laughs> good. All right. Now you guys are stuck with me. We're on our way now to the sound check at the Great Hall. Hopefully, we find the venue. Spencer's missing out on all the pre-event fun, like singing and songs and dancing. Look. It's almost time. Oh, the music's off. Cool. It's time. We're, we're going on soon. Get ready. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Spencer West. Thank you so much. That's so nice. Um, before we get started, can you thank the entire ensemble team for putting this incredible night together? It's still super warm it's out. It's very confusing. All right, ensemble night is over. Stillmans were amazing. Kenya Boys Choir was amazing. What a day. Now it's time to go to bed because we got a full day for the next two days. As always, you're my new best friend. Come every five minutes. Bye.